Hello everybody, welcome to bestunder.net and today we bring you a list of the best ultrabooks that you should consider buying in mid-2017. Laptops usually are sort of heavy and hence significantly add up to the bulk when carrying it around while traveling. Tablets on the other hand are very light but the keyboard is missing and also they cannot fill in the shoes of a laptop in terms of productivity and usability. So somewhere in between them are the thin and light sweet spot also known as the ultrabooks. So today in this video we bring you the best ultrabooks available in the market as of mid-2017. All of them come in multiple configurations and you can choose the best according to your budget and needs. And almost all these devices are equipped with Thunderbolt 3 port for external GPU support. As usual, Best Buy links are given in the description below, be sure to check them out. So in no particular order, we have a first pick, the Dell XPS 13 9360. This second generation XPS 13 laptop is one of the best selling laptops in the market and comes in i3, i5 and i7 7th gen variants with the pricing varying from $800 to $1400 according to the model you choose. The XPS 13 has an amazing aluminium build quality, stunning full HD infinity edge display, well built carbon fiber keyboard and a tactile touchpad with Windows precision drivers. Additionally, the laptop has one of the best battery lives available on an Ultrabook. All things aside, this is a great value laptop and reasonably priced as compared to other upcoming laptops on this list. Second, we have the stunning and lightweight Razer Blade Stealth which comes with great performance and great value for money. The laptop has a beautiful customizable keyboard with individually lit keys and one of the best speakers in a Windows Ultrabook. The Razer Blade Stealth offers better specs for less money than the competition and includes features that others lack such as a vivid quad HD display and full-size USB ports. The design is super sleek, price is right and the webcam is one of the best for video calling. With an extended battery life and top-notch performance, the KB Lake CPU equipped Razer Blade Stealth remains one of the prettiest, most powerful ultra portables on the market and is even better than its highly rated predecessor. The basic model starts from $900 up to $1800 for the prime variant. Third, we have the impressively light LG Gram 13 2017 variant starting at $900. The laptop has enough connections and ports to satisfy business users and has a fingerprint reader built into the touchpad for extra security. It's available with or without a touchscreen. The full HD screen does wobble a little bit but the keyboard area is just super strong. Despite many fine qualities, its appearance is pretty uninspiring and while the lightweight but strong chassis is appreciated, the gram feels flimsy compared to aluminium. Also USB-C port doesn't support Thunderbolt 3. Thanks to some helpful extras, a slim, lightweight design and double-digit battery life, the LG Gram makes a fine everyday, all-day traveling companion. Next on the list, we have the best 2-in-1 flipbook, the HP Spectre X360. This 2-in-1 laptop from HP has a very good build quality and an equally good keyboard. The speakers on this device are one of the best, not as good as the MacBooks, but yes, very reasonably good. The addition of active pen support and the option of a 4K UHD screen, even despite a few trade-offs in performance, makes it a great little laptop. But if battery life matters to you a lot, opt for the HD display, not the more expensive 4K. Battery life takes a notable hit with the 4K display compared to high definition. There's no micro SD card slot but the laptop as a whole is a superb 2-in-1 with basic models starting from $1000. With a stunning design, great battery life and top-notch performance, the latest version of the already great HP Spectre X360 is definitely our favorite high-end convertible laptop. The next two laptops to feature on our list are premium laptops and hence costly but worth the premium paid. First we have the newly launched Microsoft's most direct shot at the MacBook, the Surface Laptop. Microsoft continues its winning streak with the brilliant Surface Laptop which combines a thin and light design with powerful components. This feels and looks like a premium device while also feeling like a strong and robust machine that you wouldn't worry about carrying around with you. It initially comes with the Windows 10S but upgrading to Windows 10 Pro is free for the moment. 
The problem with Tennis is that many common apps aren't in the Microsoft Store and the Tennis does neither support executable files nor the command prompt. Also, the laptop provides excellent battery life inside an attractive package, but if you want more control, freedom and flexibility over your laptop, like upgrading, etc., then this is not the device for you. The price is also quite expensive compared to competing devices. Microsoft offers four colors for the Surface laptop, though they are currently not available throughout the full product line, but only on the $1300 variant, which the company knows will sell the most. Finally, we have the 2017 13-inch MacBook Pro without the touch bar. This device needs no introduction, the 2017 version is also as usual expensive but has the best build quality, brilliant retina display, tactile trackpad, best battery life and finally the most powerful speakers a laptop can have. The laptop pricing starts from $1300 for the basic model and comes with a very nice hardware for the price considering it's Apple. It is pricey but smokes the competing Windows laptop's performance and offers improved graphics for the KB Lake processors. For now, MacBook Pro is the best but it comes at a cost that alienates new users and with ports that will frustrate Pro users. You're going to need adapters and you might need lots of them. So these were the best thin and light ultrabooks that you should consider while buying this year. All of them are good and the decision to buy depends on what and where you can compromise because there's nothing known as a perfect ultrabook. Thanks for watching. Best Buy links are given in the description below. Also, if you have any question, then drop it in the comment section. We'll try our best to help you out. If you liked the video, then give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe.